All right, all right. So um, today I just found a stock called ENOB. So this stock is uh, gapping up 150% so far in the open market, but in pre-market was 106, 175%. And the second leader gopper, I got um, RAPT, so 48%. This one is kind of expensive stock, it's a $27 stock, so I don't deal with that, too expensive. So, and now I just made my first trade right now, about 5,000 share. I was able to make a 50 cent for each share that I bought. So that's $2,500 so far. So not good for Monday morning. But the only thing about it, um, enough. I don't like the flow. It got too much flow on it. So you couldn't hold the support level. Open 11.64 and then went up all the way to 12.99 and then it dropped right away. So, so I'm waiting to see, man, the volume is not too bad, but I don't like the flow. You got a lot of flow. That's right, the stock, it can go up like that. Uh, I'm just going to wait and see what happened. It's still early. So it's only 6, 6, 44 in the morning right now. So. Let's check on. MDR. MDR A and C. Medical Holding Corporation. Oh, this one. You know, this one was did good on pre, uh, after market on Friday afternoon, and they had a good news, but it's not volume at all. So let's see what happened. Like I said, it's still earlier. So this one is scoping up our 37%. So vamos a esperar a ver qué pasa con estas dos acciones. Pero por lo pronto es todo lo que hay en el stock market hoy. So it's going to sit back and relax. Uh, see if I can, um, I'm going to try to do at least one more trade before seven. But I'm waiting on ENOB and see what's going to happen right now. But so far, it's not holding on support level. So. I'm not trying to buy a thousand shares. Eleven, let me see. So Eleven thirties. It's in the thirties right now. Let's see what happened. It's trading below the big one so far. And that right here in the morning make a quick big move, but then. Lo aguantó el soporte y se desplomó para abajo. Okay. MDIA is scoping up a little bit. 
But let's see if it's gonna hold the support level. On the other hand, I missed the answer right here. Wow. Let's see. Oh, wow. Okay, by 11, 1189, I was able to say 1196. Okay, seven cents, that's not bad. Just made a little 70 bucks. Okay, that's my second trade for today. I thought I was gonna go over $12, but it didn't. It dropped right quick. Uh, you gotta be careful with this stack right here because uh, the daily chart is messed up. I don't like it, it's very choppy. It's been like that in pre-market, go up and down, up and down. No support levels at all. So I gotta be really careful with this, uh, with this uh, stack right here. So twenty five hundred dollars. It's not bad for be a Monday. I'm gonna hold on, sit back and relax, and see is uh E N R B or M D O M D I A. You know, get more volatile. But so far, uh. I don't see that. All right, remember guys, like I said before, man, day trading is very risky. I won't recommend nobody to start trading real money until you know what you're doing. You can make money easy, but you can lose money really easy too. If you're interested in learning how to day trading, Joe, so just let me know. That's what I'm here for. So now that pandemic is uh, it's going away, so I can train people like one-on-one -on -one with no problem. That's what I like. I like to do it one-on-one. -on -one. That's the best way to do it. So, so far, that's what I got for today. So, um, like I said, right now, I'm just taking a little break and uh, sit back on the lag and see uh, what happened in the next two hours. So, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, uh, Brad Trading, you know. Should you share the video, give you thumbs up. You know, if you like the video, if you don't, that's okay. I appreciate it. Thank you.